as Sunny aka the Ren Recorder here. It's an unboxing video! This box showed up today, uh, by which I mean I ordered it on Amazon. Uh, you can see Marvel Collector Core, Marvel Studios, the first 10 years, and that is obviously on the box. So basically, for those of you that don't know, uh, there's a company called Funko who make things like Funko Pops, you've probably already seen it. I'm going to see if I can post a video up on the screen right now. And so they make a subscription box in partnership with Marvel. You can only get it on Amazon. And that is going to be, this is part of the Marvel Studios 10th anniversary film festival celebrating Stan Lee. Uh, so yeah, so just for a second, I want to appreciate this box. This is like really nice. It has black on Without further ado, let's open this box. <laughs> there is actually, I don't even know if there's stuff to cut in this box. Hold on. No, okay, no, okay, there's there's one piece of tape. So we're just gonna go ahead and. By the way, if you're watching this, that was dumb because you should never cut towards yourself. That's one of the first things I learned about cutting things. And. Yo, how does this box open? I feel dumb because I cannot figure out how to open it. Yes, so just open the bottom. Yes. Remember? Yo, honey? Does it, does it come out from the side? What? I'll be back in a sec. I'm just going to try to get my back. Okay, so after some small technical difficulties, we have it open. And I'm going to try not to open the box because there's always one exclusive Funko Pop in here. I mean, there's everything in here is exclusive, but that's like the big item, the big ticket item. So if I feel it in here, so like this big box, there's a card on top of it. Oh, so it advertises next month's theme for X-Men, and I think the other side, yeah. So I'll let you guys have a peek into the box before I take a look. And I'm going to cover up the phone. Oh, okay. A lot of times with this kind of thing, there's cool stuff. So... First thing we have here is some pint-sized heroes. I didn't know I would need scissors. I just thought the knife would be enough. I see these all the time on Twitter. So it looks like they're all... There are 12 different ones you can get, and I'll show you the different kinds. You can see. So there is... Captain America, the Hulk, Thor, Loki. Uh, I think that's Iron Man or Iron Man Sentry. I, I think it's full silver suit, but I don't think it's too common. Uh, Thanos, Shuri, and Tony Stark, uh, Red Skull or Hela, which is, uh, I don't know if this comes in wave. Then we have, oh, I'm looking at, I can see like the side of the box for the Funko Pop is huge. Okay, so next we have a Pez dispenser. That's weird. I didn't, uh, I know Pops, I know Funko makes Pez dispensers, but I didn't think, okay. That's just like a weird thing to put in here, so we'll go ahead and take that out of the box. This one is gold. I've been seeing them do that a lot lately. Lately, with the Marvel Studios 10th anniversary stuff, they just make it gold. And I like this one especially because it's the Hulk. The Hulk is one of my favorite characters. So, I'll go ahead and show you guys a bit of a closer look at him right now. And it's just has, it has nice uh, detailing on it. It's him when he went to Sakaar, so it has the little gladiator helmet with the... I think it's plume is what they call the thing on the head. I've never actually owned a pen. I don't. I don't. I've never owned a pen dispenser, so I don't know how to use one. And you are done. There you go. Your Pez dispenser is loaded, all in one shot. Uh, you're ready to eat some delicious Pez candy. Um, next we have oh another pint size hero. Oh, I guess that's we get. And then we have. Big guy. I'm not going to look at it. Y'all can see it right now. Just trying to make sure. Yeah. Okay, there's nothing else in the box. Oh, dang. Y'all y'all see this? Oh, y'all only saw it from this side. Okay. So this is Funko Pop movie moments. I Basically what this is, is they take a pop, or they take a movie, such as Iron Man 2, as you can see, and they'll just take there for Marvel Studios' 10th anniversary. That was weird. Okay, I'm gonna try to keep this box safe because I might end up. I don't know if I'll put it back in here, but 
because it does have that really nice backdrop to it. But this is really nice. Actually, Mark V was um, one of my favorite suits. So in the comment section, actually let me know who your favorite Avengers were, or uh, if you don't, if you, have, I mean, if you like them all, which makes sense. I mean, uh, 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 what your favorite Iron Man suit is? I have to say, for me, it's either Mark Forty Two or Mark Fifty because I, I just always love the way that this looks and that scene in the movie where he put he like slams the briefcase to his chest I just always found that cool I will say Iron Man 2 wasn't the best movie. You have Whiplash over here. Um, I honestly can't remember his name. It's been it's been a little bit since I saw the movie, but um. All right, so we're back. So not only have I used a knife, we now have a pair of scissors. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Wolverine. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I wish. Dude, I'm so sad he definitely left that hole. But uh, anyway, let's open our first fancy scissors. I don't know if it'll be like you open the bag and then there's a smaller gun bag because I've seen that happen a lot with this type of thing. I've seen that. I got. Oh, it's gold. That's weird. I store from Sakar, I think. Here, let me look at the Thor one. And I, I I like how small it is, but also like. There's, there's a pretty good amount of detail put in here. I feel like this one specifically, though, would look so much better if it were painted. I have to say, Thor 3, or uh, Ragnarok, was definitely, like, one of my favorite MCU movies, by far, because it's just fun. And I love that. I mean, if, if the, I'm more of a guy that looks for my movies being funny. I mean, yes, the action matters, but also, oh, this isn't a, I want, I feel like this one is also going to be gold, but I'm not sure. Um, I hope this one isn't also Thor, by the way. Okay, so let me... It's Thanos! Let's go, Thanos! Okay, I can't be mad about that one. There's nothing else to say. It's Thanos, right? Yeah, I mean, the purple guy from Fortnite, I don't know why he's in a Marvel box, actually. Because, I, I don't know, do they, do they put a Fortnite character in the Marvel movies? That'd be weird, dude. I, that'd be cool, because Fortnite is kind of mainstream these days. I assume this is Thanos. His chin is what gives it away. I'm gonna be honest. I mean, because he's all the same color, so I can't really tell if he's purple or not. Uh, but yeah, no. Based off of all of these, this is yeah. This is Thanos. It's funny because I have Thanos and Thor and Hulk, so it's like I actually also have the Thanos Funko Pop. But this is Thanos and Thor and Hulk, so it's kind of like from the uh, Infinity War. I'm not gonna spoil it if you haven't seen if you haven't seen the movie. Kind of like the beginning of a video word. That's all. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I wanna say. But yeah, I have to say, and this one is gold too. I just uh, to point that out. So I'll go ahead and show you guys a small comparison of them, and then you can see what we have got. Cause I have to say, this. I'm not for anything, and I have to say. Thanos, one of my favorite characters. He killed all the fodder characters, like that that Arachnid Kid guy. I'm not gonna spoil it if you haven't seen if you haven't seen the movie. <sighs> so annoying. His honestly though, like I like I, I low key do like Thanos a lot as a character. Um, and then this dude, honestly, this makes the whole box. I mean, I and I, I don't get me wrong, cause I'd be happy to buy any of these, but this just alone, like kind of like carries the box. I'll go ahead and get some stuff to compare it to real quick and I'll show you a small round shot of all of the stuff we have. So I've brought a number of things in to compare with all of the items we have, but let's start with this one. So we have, uh, this is a Rocket Raccoon Funko Pop. I got this out of another mystery box. Cool story, by the way. I know a lot of you are probably gonna skip this part, but basically, I actually got- Mystery box from Funko, uh, from Rosie Bubbles, I got it there. And, um, they have a limited edition, so, like, and um, the funny thing is, is I actually planned on making a video about it where I unboxed it. And I recorded it and everything too, um, but I just never uploaded it because it was, I, it was probably better quality than this video is, but like even then it was, it was horrible because 
this video is probably bad. Uh, but anyway, you have the Rocket Raccoon pop, and it's pretty much the same height. Standard 3.5 inches. Um, this is the 6 inch pop. And you can see, he obviously, because they have the stand, he's still taller though. Purple guy from Fortnite, obviously, with the a million glove, or the power paw. And he's still taller. Uh, obviously, that makes sense. He's a six inch. Tall. And, yeah, so you can see it's not because of this. Then the next thing we have, uh, I'll get the pint size heroes. And so, purple, and Thor. And so, this is a standard. Lego minifigure, y'all, y'all know who it is. So, we all know who we're getting today. It's Santa Darth Vader himself. So this is our finished Darth Vader Santa. So I really like how he's got. He's actually taller than them, but they are like, Thicker, not thicker. Their heads are a lot thicker. Their his their their heads are thicker than his entire body, but uh, I guess his helmet just fell off. But whatever. Uh, as you can see, uh, them side by side. But uh, before I drop it, uh, you can see. Anyway, for a quick recap, we got a golden Hulk Pez dispenser that I. Oh, I was about to say that I misplaced the Pez too, but. I got him. Uh, the Golden Hulk Pez Dispenser. Two Mystery Pint Size Heroes. I don't actually know. I'm so bad at this. Anyway, two Pint Size Heroes. And if you are in the box, you can obviously get any one. I got Thor and the Power Paw Boy. Powery Paw Boy. Hacks Boy. Um, Thanos, you can go over there. And this, uh, I honestly, this, like, kind of does leave me speechless. This is, like, just beautiful to me. If you like this video, I mean, if you stayed this long, you probably liked the video. I'm gonna try to do more things like this. Again, we're right in the midst of the, well, actually, not the midst, because th this is probably the first video, but we're about if you like, if you stayed this long, you probably liked it. So make sure to leave a like, leave a comment. Again, tell me who your favorite Avenger is. Remember, peace out, baby.